Hi guys, today I'll be showing you step-by-step -step how to download our mobile presets onto your iPhone. So first of all, I want you to go into your app store and download three applications, one called Zip Extractor, Lightroom CC, and Files, as you see here on my home screen. So you will go into your app store and search Lightroom and it will come up with your Adobe Lightroom photos. Click download. Now, once you have done that, you will create your own account as I have already done. So we can get out of that one now and you will continue to download on your app store the other two applications that I have mentioned. Now, we will be going on to Google and searching Wandering Oz, as I have in the top here, and then you will click onto our shop over on our website and purchase our presets for your mobile. Once you have completed your purchase, you will receive an email from Wandering Oz to say that you have received your mobile downloads and for your desktop also. We will then click onto mobile downloads. You will see here that it comes up with download. Click on that button. In the top right hand corner, there is the arrow that you see that is downloading our presets onto our phone. Once that is completed, we will click onto that arrow and click again. And here we have it. So we'll get out of that screen and that one and go into Zip Extractor and click Home. Now, once you have clicked on Home, you will come up to this screen and it will have a image with the letter I in the middle, press on that and go open in. Open in Lightroom, launch Lightroom now. So you will click on all photos and see that Boho has been added to our Lightroom images. We'll go back and do the same for Esperance. Open in Lightroom, launch Lightroom now and again. We have Esperance and we continue to do that for every single preset. Now we'll go Gypsy, launch Lightroom now. So there we have our three and we will continue to do the rest, but I'm going to show you the next step. So we click onto Esperance and click the button up in the top right hand corner and go create preset. For first time users, you will need to create your preset group, which I already have done so. So Ultimate Wandering Preset Group, I'm going to click and then name your um, preset, which is called Esperance. So Esperance, and then you click that up the top and then that's done. And continue to do that for the rest of your presets. You do have to do it individually and do not forget to press Preset Group and add your preset group here. So Ultimate Wandering Presets, and this is called Boho. And the next one, Gypsy, do that one again and go Ultimate Wandering Presets and then Gypsy. Okay, now once you have done that, you can upload your own photos from your camera roll or your files and edit your photo. So once you are on this, go to your bottom screen and slide across to Presets. Right here, you have the presets that come already on Lightroom mobile and you will click on the presets that you want. So I'm going to go to Ultimate Wandering Presets where I've downloaded already 10 of them. So these are all of our presets and I will just show you basically how to edit your photo. So our first one that we can choose is Boho. For me, that's not really my style of this photo. So I'm going to go to my next one, Esperance. That's looking more like what I want. Gypsy, not really suiting the style of the photo. So you go through and choose what you would like for your photo. And then, so I'm going to go back to Esperance and click on the tick in the bottom right hand corner. To add a little bit more detail, you can then add or get rid of some lighting, which I'm pretty happy with the lighting. You can change the contrast of your photo and highlight 
so you can have more highlight you can see there in the clouds that there's less highlights and more which I'll go leave it as is and then you can actually change the color and you'll see in this little box that I've just clicked on that you can go up to the top corner and it says mix I'm going to click on that so my tones that I really want to stand out today is say my orange so here in saturation you can tone it up down to whatever you like so I'm just going to tone it not too much but just so it's a nice effect and go there so once you've done that, you can then go onto your other colors that you want to brighten up. So it may be green for the trees and you can just change the color just slightly off the trees, which I don't really want the trees to be super green, which is generally like the basic photo anyway that we took with our drone. So that's how you, how you do it. And also with photos, I'm a bit particular with my photos and I like to straighten my photos up so you can go here and straighten up your horizon of your photos which you don't have to do this but you can definitely add that in so it definitely it really adds to your photos for um, Instagram for the square you can click on here and change your ratio of your photo so I always click on square and then there you have it so you click the bottom right hand corner and go with the tick and there you have your first photo so to save this to your phone you then go up to the top um, corner and click on that and go export to camera roll and that's it that's all you have to do so guys I hope this video has helped you get your Lightroom presets onto your phone if you do have any troubles please feel free to contact us and we can't wait to see your photos please send us in some photos Thanks guys, have a great day.